In about 20 minutes, you can get this delicious, rich noodle stir fry on the table. And I guarantee the family are gonna devour it. Hi, I'm Nikki. Welcome back to our kitchen, where we show you how to make delicious, family-friendly recipes. Pad Siu is a really tasty, savoury noodle stir fry. We've got eggs, chicken and Chinese broccoli in there as well. And it all comes together with a nice garlicky oyster soy sauce. So we're gonna start with the noodles. And I've got 300 grams, which is about 10 and a half ounces of rice noodles here, nice thick ones. The thicker the better really, but that was as thick as I could get it. And we're gonna put those in boiling water for about two minutes less than the pack instructions. So for us, that's about eight minutes. While those noodles are softening, we're going to make the sauce. So to a small bowl, add four tablespoons of oyster sauce. Three tablespoons of light soy sauce. Two tablespoons of dark soy sauce. A tablespoon of fish sauce. Three tablespoons of white or light brown sugar and a quarter of a teaspoon of white pepper and then stir it all together to combine. So let's talk a little bit about the Chinese broccoli. Now you can buy this at most Asian stores. And this is a traditional ingredient in Pad Siu. It's quite stalky and leafy and quite iron rich. If you can't get hold of it, then you can replace it with half tender stem broccoli stalks and half bok choy. Now the stalks and the leaves cook at different timings. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna chop off those stalks and then slice them in half lengthways and then they go in first and then the leaves get added later. Now we're gonna heat the wok over a high heat and add two tablespoons of oil. Add 300 grams or 10 and a half ounces of chicken thighs that have been chopped into small pieces, plus a quarter of a teaspoon each of salt and pepper. And we're gonna fry those over that high heat, stirring often for about five minutes until the chicken's lightly browned and cooked all the way through. While that chicken's cooking, we're going to drain the noodles and then we'll run them under a little bit of cold water and stir in a teaspoon of oil just to stop it from sticking together. Once that chicken's cooked, add in the Chinese broccoli stalks and stir fry for two minutes, keeping everything moving around the pan constantly. Now add in those Chinese broccoli leaves plus four garlic cloves that have been finely chopped. And we're gonna fry that together for a further minute. Then we want to push the chicken and the broccoli to one side of the wok. Crack two eggs into the space and then we want to scramble those eggs up. Once the eggs are scrambled, mix everything together and then transfer the contents of the wok to a bowl. Now we're gonna add a tablespoon of oil to the wok and add the drained noodles plus three tablespoons of the sauce mixture. Fry the noodles for two to three minutes over a high heat, tossing once or twice. We want those noodles to be slightly charred and caramelised for that authentic flavour. Now we're going to add in the remaining sauce plus that chicken, egg and Chinese broccoli back to the wok. Stir fry for a further minute, tossing everything together and we're ready to serve. Divide the noodles between bowls and I like to drizzle on a little bit of chilli vinegar. 
If you can't find this in the shops, then it's really easy to make your own. And I'll share the instructions for that in the description below. If you love quick stir fries, then there's some more ideas for you here. Happy cooking. <laughs> Thank mm -hmm. you.